How are you doing today? It's Michael from Starstreams and we are going to be looking at Underspace in this video. It is a game that started off as a Kickstarter, I believe. It's from Pasta Space Interactive. It is a single player open world space arcade dogfighting game where every star system is crafted by hand and every system has something to see or do. What we're going to do is a quick kind of summary, I guess, review of this game. So we're going to skip the dialogue as much as we can and just get into the actual physical gameplay itself. So let's hit new game. So it is a story driven single player this game. This is Speaker Freighter Gold Convoy 7 to Battleship Hemadred, requesting weather update. Gold 7, we read you. Skies are currently clear. UHC trackers report a Category 2 storm on its way to the system. Estimated time of arrival is five hours, with three Star Chasers already in pursuit of its core. Hemadred out. Gold 6, what's your status? Cargo's intact. System check reports no issue. Nav computer is saying we've got two hours until the jump hole and it's stable. Acknowledged. Let's get this shipment home, gentlemen. Status report! Storm signal is going off! What? That's impossible. Gold 3 just went down. Full hull breach on multiple decks, both transports. Open a channel on all frequencies and shunt all power to comms. Battleship Hemadred, this is Gold 7. We are under attack. Repeat SOS. We have taken heavy storm damage. Gold 7, we read you and our scrambling fighters. Requesting status on your attacker. Gold 7, we read no storm. Repeat, what are you under attack from? I... don't... know. Okay, that's the introduction. And all gets explained in the next bit of dialogue. In just a moment. But if I can skip it, I will. I mean, I don't think I can, but... Hangar decks, please. Hasn't even been an hour, and they've already got billboards up. So the court convicted you. It's bad, and it's all bad. But not as bad as it could be. Hmm. Let's get this out of the way. Your fortunes are gone. That's the worst one. You have a small stipend. So okay, so I'm start. just going to explain this little bit, and then it's going to start getting me to answer questions and stuff, which I am going to skip through. But ultimately here, those two freighters were part of my company. I am an ex-CEO and quite a high-standing person. Now, I took out insurance very recently on those two ships, and then lo and behold, they blow up, and it, it turns out that my company is not doing that well financially. So it's highly suspicious that it could be like a, an insurance fraud or something. Um, so that's basically what I've been accused of. And may, what, what gives it that, that suggestion is that, if you remember the pilots, the pilots were saying, we're under attack. The security people that were behind saying they don't detect a cloud storm. So, and we saw, if you remember, we saw a flash of what looked like a ship behind them just before they got shot down. So, it, it looks really highly suspicious. Now, I would have been prosecuted for this, but I'm of high standing. And so what they've done instead is they've told me just to leave the system. You cannot start up a new business in the system just go somewhere else. So this is where I am now. I'm kind of homeless in a way. And I'm looking for my next move. So I'm just going to skip really quickly through this text. This is just the extra fleshed out backstory. The way I see it, the only option left to you is star chasing. How? I have no money, no assets. I doubt most people would give me a job. I don't even have a ship. That's not completely true. I managed to drag this thing. I will say the sounds are a little bit messed up. The audio levels are quite difficult on this game to uh, to manage, but talk to the chapter master here on Valdric. They're a Macrovari. They won't care about your trial or anything else if they even know who you are. In the meantime, 
If you need anything, you know where to find me. You'll get through this, Cardoz. You're nothing if not competent. Thanks, Carbell. What else are friends for? So here I am then. This is one of the main stations and but ultimately, if I want to toggle the mouse button now, I press the right bus button and it allows me to pick up all of these things here. So uh, warp to launch bay, warp to bar, equipment dealer, cargo trader, ship dealer and chapter house. I need to go to chapter house next. That's where you set up your campaigns and then launch to space. And then over this side, we've got infantry. We've got star map, character and reputation, uh, current objective and log and additional information now what we're going to do is work our way to the chapter house because that's what they wanted us to do your strength thin, but you've got to give me something a low-risk cruiser some military adjuncts anything we're getting thrashed out here that'd be up to the consortium not me and with the way things are going it's What's quite wordy at times but it's it, i guess it's pretty cool because it's a backstory if you're really if you're really interested in this sort of backstory then you can dig right into it just good. Some people love that, you know. I think this is the chapter master here. Oh god, that was so loud. Yeah. One thing I would recommend for the devs, if you're watching this, devs, is I would really fix the audio levels because they're a little bit off. I think you could probably do it in menu, but as the defaults, the defaults are way off. I'll make it clear to him. Set out. Okay. So let's go talk to the chapter master now so he's the cat i think he's the one who assigns campaigns yeah we're just gonna because this is a surface level uh first look on this video we're not really going to get into too much detail on the story itself so we've got a we've got a an option here escort a convoy from one location to another location pay out was sixty five thousand, and i'm gonna say i'm in First day on the job. There we go. So, one of the things that's pretty obvious, and I did this off video, is that you start off with about a thousand dollars or credits or whatever currency it is, which is not enough to do anything really. You can't upgrade your ship or do anything. So, you have to take a couple of missions, first of all, to be able to bring some money up so that you can uh, customize your ship. So the next thing we're going to do is go launch into space. So we do the right mouse button and then we'll hover over launch to space. Right, before I do this, guys, what does this what does this game remind you of? Literally a clone of a, of another game. And and I I'd love to see if you can guess what game I'm thinking of right now. Now bear in mind you got the bar, the dealer, the cargo trader. Let me know what you think this game reminds me of. Put it in the comments right now. Launch lanes open. <laughs> See what I mean? See what I mean? Pat told me we had new star chasers joining. Welcome to the Come on. Smashers. Rishan, looks like you've got another Valdwin to chat with. Pat, he looks Academy. Pat said he's a veteran. I'm sure he's willing to prove... So down here is my, my weapons. Call me Cardoz. Over here right then, is Cardoz. like star we'll maps and stuff like that. Current this is my local people. Some extra flight controls. Yep. Okay. Accept. Fly to the waypoint. I'm going to click on the waypoint here, and then I'm going to fly F2. Did that work? Oh yeah. I guess this is warp. Wait. Isn't the fly? Isn't it here? Left and right is strafe, A and D, select a target, left mouse, strafe, vertical, yeah, okay. Right, dock with the landline, lane line even. Wait, no problem, I can do that. So click on this, and we've got a dock. I forgot what dock is. Oh, 
put it through the bottom ring. Okay, is it F2? I think it's F2 to dock. Oh, that's go to. Right, there we go. Oh, what's happening? Maybe it's F1 to enter. No entry here. Do I have to literally click on this? I think I have to click on, hang on, space. Click on this, F1, F3. Oh, I don't know what it is. F2, do I literally go in? Flying formation. We're literally just floating around now. Oh, let me find out what, <laughs> let's see what the controls are. Interact, menu, menu, open infantry, scan. Go to target, cancel autopilot. Am I on autopilot then? And then we do F2, right? Oh, this is weird. This is weird. I mean, it does say no entry. Why can't I, why can't I turn? Right, okay, so what we're going to do is just go, oh! There we go! You just fly into it. You just fly into it. This is what I was saying. They're desperate. Pirates have always been a problem along this route. Normal lane line raids, sure. But these aren't your typical washers. They're much more organized. Let's get to work. Okay, we can do that. Where are they? Oh, there they are. Okay. Uh... Am I supposed to be aiming at the dot? I guess so. Oh, he's got a shield on? Oh my goodness. I just shot something else. I don't know what it was. Oh. Ah. Very sensitive. Wait, is that my ship or not? No, that's not my ship. This. Ah. This is my ship. Too far away. I like the boost on it. I like it. Did we do it? Is there another one? Wait. What's happening? Oh, there is one. I couldn't see it. The combat's really good on this, I have to say. Quite fun. Very arcadey. Whoa! I think we're done. That was the last of them. I expected more resistance. Hmm. Let's get through to Spolin. Recharge shields G. Hold to repair hull. G. Uh, hold it. Collect nearby cargo B. So again, it's like that other game that we won't mention. There we go. Reach Spoolen train yard. Okay. Okay. So I guess. Wait, if I bring up the bigger map. Reach Spoolen train yard. It's there. So I think what I'm going to do. Is man oh, you have to go through the waypoint? Okay, I uh, don't know which way though. This way? It might be the other way. <laughs> oh, wait. I've gone the wrong way. It's up here then. I'm still getting used to this. Oh. We made it. Something feels off. 
I'm getting used Red to this now, guys. We heard you ran into some trouble. Less trouble than we thought. Where are your escorts? They stayed behind. Had Look at that. that. That's pretty cool. Take care of. Was there any sign of him? None that we could see. Rishan's right. Something's off. Yoon. What about Green Squad? They should have been the first to arrive. I haven't heard anything. Yoon, Rick and Ren's shipyard isn't responding. Green Squad was supposed to launch from there. Damn it! Cardaws, we're forming up on you. Let's get to Rick and Rend, but stay alert. Okay, so I now have to uh, set that as my waypoint. Wait, am I going back through here again? Do I just do go to? Hang on. Oh, it's quicker, isn't it? If I do go to, it's a lot quicker. There we go. All right. I really like it so far. I think it's pretty cool. But it is very much. You can see the influence of that other game. This is UHC Greenwood. We need reinforcements at Rick and Red Shipyard. It's gone. The the doomsday has blew it up in the dry dock. I don't think they were after it. But we've got more coming. Get to Rick and Ren now. I think we found the rest of the washers. Break formation. Keep them away from any civilians. Oh, we got enemies. I'm getting much, much more used to this game now. It's pretty cool, I have to say. Holy crap. These dog fights are so good. I mean, are they running? Find the missing convoy. Let's go there to the waypoint. Rick and Ren down. No sign of EBCO. This is bad. What's going on here exactly? These don't seem like normal washers. They're not. You need to understand that there's a lot of sects within the Washers. Heretics or people with different interpretations of their core beliefs. Wait, where am I going? These ones, though. We call them doomsdayers. They're crazy even by crazy standards. Am I doing this right? I, should really I have done the trade lane? Right. A couple of weeks ago... Sorry, the not the trade lane. The, um... Well, that's what They've they used to call them in Freelancer. To out and out looting, no, there's no lanes here. I'm going out into the open. Let me know what you think about this game so far. Drop it in the comments. Their crazy schemes have succeeded just enough to give them an edge. Now, so I'm not really allowed to. This is the system I'm not allowed to um, trade in. Suicidal as they may be, they don't stick around. They've been able to give us the slip more times than Hat would care to admit. What are they looting? What are they after? I'm not sure. Hat's more into that kind of overarching plot stuff than I am. He thinks they're building something. If they I'm are, thinking about on the channel 
I'm thinking about if we want to do a live stream of these sort of games, because I'm covering a lot of games now, obviously. Maybe we can use the thumbs ups as a suggestion. So if we get like 30 thumbs ups, I'll do it as a live stream playthrough or something. I, I think that's a pretty cool idea. So the more popular the game is, the more thumbs ups, the more I'm going to cover it. How That sounds good, right? So less thumbs ups mean less likely to cover, to put, you know, coverage on it. Bravado? No sign of him. Understood. Everyone get ready. I, I don't know if there was a quicker way to do this, but... Reading gravity surges near some wreckage. All right, we'll take out these. Oh, look at that. What's that? That's, oh, that's a nebula. How cool is that? I love the music, by the way. Holy crap. <laughs> oh, the combat. Okay. I'll come back to this in a minute. I'll come back to this in a minute. I've got... I did want to say something about the combat. Wow. I love these dog fights. I love them. I can only imagine what it's like with more powerful ships and dog fights. It would be pretty intense. There is a real trend of bringing back arcade-like games at the moment, you know? Like, more kind of stylized, And I love it. This is a good time for gaming. You know? I can't... Oh my god, I can't connect. Let me, let me get near there, this guy then. So I'm giving myself a quick boost. near him. Right, well, I'll, I'll tell you what I was going to say in a second once I've sorted this guy out. Okay. Oh! Oh! I've not been picking up the... Uh, I've not been pressing Gs. And Bs. So I will say the uh, the combat is, is an upgrade on Freelancer. Definitely. Definitely. Alright, I think we're going to stop it here. Thank you very much for tuning in. This was a first look at uh, Under Space. But this is what Freelancer 2 would look like, right? Very impressed. Love it. What do you think? Do you want to do it as a live stream? Let me know. I'll see you on the next video. Take care. Goodbye. And have a fun day. <laughs> Bye.